NBC 10 breaking news. All right, we, we have breaking news. It is very exciting. Eagles going to the Super Bowl. You're taking a live look at the link right now. And we do have Sky Force 10 up above Cotman and Frankfurt. Can we get that shot? All right, well, here's a live. There, there you go, it right is. There. Yeah, that's right. A lot of people out there celebrating uh, the Eagles win. It's official. The Eagles are going to Super Bowl 57. The Birds beat the 49ers 31 to 7. And here's a live look at the scene at Common in Frankfurt in Northeast Philadelphia. The team in just a few minutes will be formally introduced as the 2023 NFC champions. And we just took that live shot right before the break, right before we came on air with this breaking news, this very exciting update. The crowds really are just gathering so quickly. We saw them leaving in Xfinity Live. We saw them in Brian Sheehan's shot. I can't wait to go from point to point to see how quickly it grows because it really does happen fast. And it's still very early. The this night is just is young. the beginning. <laughs> this is just the beginning, what you see right now uh, live in uh, Northeast Philadelphia. A lot of people are going to be celebrating. If we take a look behind wow. us, we have the fireworks at it's the Lincoln Financial official. Field. It's official. That's right. Your NFC championships. Absolutely beautiful to see the fireworks in green, of yes. course. Uh, being set off right now. Let's go out to Leah Uko, who is live right now. How's it looking where you are, Leah? Hi! Okay, so I'm going to step out of the way because the crowd has been so nice and so patient, but they got something to say. Hold on, let's come over here, Jorge, right quick. Where did she go? There was a young lady over here we wanted to talk to. Oh, you know what? She's gone. Okay, so everybody... Okay, wait, 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 wait. We are live TV. So let me, for everybody at home who may not understand, who may have just visited Philadelphia, may have just moved, and they want to understand what does it mean a Philly thing? Why are people so excited? Why are people so excited about this move? Honestly, it's Let's been about four back. years. Let's go 20, 2018 is the last time we got into it. Yeah. Now we're 2023. Let's go, Eagles! Let's go the Super Bowl. Just one second. I want to show you what it looks like over here because, y'all, it is so beautifully turned up here. We are on Broad and Porter Street. They have closed down uh, the street here because fans, of course, they are excited. They have been keeping their excitement boiled up. And now they're <laughs> taking to the streets all the way down here. We got Philadelphia PD have blocked all the street corners and they're telling traffic to not come through this way. But look at this, Jorge, let's show them what, what just how excited. Drivers have even been coming through areas though that they had initially blocked off, but they said, you know what? As long as people are staying relatively calm, we're just gonna have to take the L. This is just how excited people are. Hold on, okay, since you're trying to do my job, okay. Okay, let's answer this question. First of all, why are you so excited? Besides they won, but for people to understand why Philadelphia is so excited about this. Uh, we, were, we were born for this. We were literally born for this. We're going to the Super Bowl. This happened three times in my entire life. That's it, that's it. What's your name? Colin Strap. Colin Strap yeah. is a three-time good luck charm for my you. entire life. Yes. Okay. All right. How much time do we have left? Because there are a couple things I want to show you. Are we time to wrap up? Let me know. <laughs> I can't. I can't. All right. All right. So again, again, this this whole street is supposed to be blocked off the traffic, but people have been coming through. I want you to take a look at some of the camaraderie that's going on from our drivers here. People have been driving. <laughs> People coming out in their cars, expressing their excitement. Police have even told me off camera that they too are excited, but they have to stay kind of calm because they have a job to do. For everyone watching at home, all of our transplants, our new Philadelphians, the reason why there's so much camaraderie here is because this is more than just, you got it, officer, this is more than just sports. This is a win for Philadelphia. The city has been through a lot, a lot of drama that hasn't been good this year, but sports is the one thing that brings everybody together, and this is when they ride for their city in a way that I would have to say, I've covered seven different states in my career. I've never seen fans as loyal and energetic as Philadelphia sports fans, especially Eagles. And also, respectful for us to go live. We've been talking with people out here all day. They knew we were going to go live, and they said, you know what? We want this report to be good, so we're going to be here. <laughs> Reporting live from South Philly. Yeah.
<laughs> Leah Uko, NBC 10 News. How about a turn up now? Leah would be the one to get everyone to behave for the live <laughs> shot. As she said, beautifully turn up. Now we're taking a live look inside Xfinity Live. You can see people climbing up on the bars, on the chairs, on the tables. We also want to give you a look at Sky Force 10. Yeah, that's another shot over Cotman in Frankfurt. That is where we have Karen Hua. She is inside where you can barely hear, but outside you are seeing the crowds continue to gather. Well, we just, have just five minutes amazing. ago, that was probably half that size. And, yes. and now you can see that that crowd is just continues to grow there in Northeast Philadelphia as people celebrate the Eagles big win, the NFC championships. Just Absolutely too exciting. Amazing. We have to go to break, but we don't want to go to break. But just a quick break. We'll be right back. Don't worry. We've got you covered. Stick with us here on NBC 10. NBC 10 breaking news. We continue to follow this breaking news here. Your Philadelphia Eagles are officially going to Super Bowl 57 as we take a live picture of the Lincoln Financial Field. The Birds beat the 49ers 31 to 7 just a little bit ago. And in just minutes, the team will be formally introduced as the 2023 NFC champions. And the fans are going wild. Here's a live look inside Xfinity Live. You know, Johnny had just interviewed Justin DeSalvo, the director of operations for Xfinity Live on Friday. He was saying, everyone, if you want to get in, get there by noon. So these fans have been partying since noon. It's been over six hours. You know they have not left. They've been drinking and hopefully getting some food all day. And now they do get to celebrate a victory. And we are so excited. We also want to give you another live look at Cotman and Frankfurt. Another woman taking a sip of beer. They just continue to celebrate. <laughs> this is where we have Karen Hua. We gave you that chopper shot earlier where we saw the crowds just continuing to gather to the point where you really can't even see any empty space anymore on the screen from Sky Force 10. I mean, we have to celebrate. And, and, and this is such a, a big deal for the city of Philadelphia and, and such a dominant force against the 49ers. <laughs> there you go. All right, we're going to take a quick break and we will be right back. <laughs> <laughs> this is Sports Desk, brought to you by Xfinity Mobile. Visit XfinityMobile.com and switch today. Super Bowl 57, here we come. Look at that. The <laughs> Eagles beat the 49ers, which means they now have a shot to compete for yet another Lombardi trophy. That's right. Tim Furlong is live inside Xfinity Live with all the excited fans. Look at you out there, Tim. We're actually outside the lake, and I'll tell you what, it's chaos because the trophy ceremony happened. Everybody's now drifted out. It's crazy out here. We have a nice security guy with us kind of keeping people down because everybody is pumped. Brian, I imagine they're pumped where you are too, buddy. <laughs> yeah, Tim, it is an absolute party here on Broad Street. You can see the crowd has grown significantly since we were seeing you at the top, since we saw you at the top of the six. Fans are partying here, guys. Back to you, Johnny and Franny. Thank you, Brian. Thanks for watching NBC 10 News at 6. I'm Johnny Argent.